look really, 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 really good on a Monday. <laughs> Hello friends, I'm talking I'm talking a little quiet because I am in the living room and Jack is streaming or I don't know if he's streaming or playing with friends over there, but either way. So I was talking to my bestie Vanessa today. You've seen her in a vlog before and she asked me a really interesting question that I never like thought would be like interesting to answer. When I started answering, it was like, I should probably make a video about this just in case people are wondering. I always wondered this before I started YouTube, so I thought this would be kind of cool. It's more so how do I balance YouTube and spend so much time on YouTube with a full-time job um, and like, you know, living life and things like that. So it started with, she asked me how much time um, I spend in, in front of a computer. That's what she said for like YouTube and streaming and stuff. It came to about like after calculating all of the like shooting and editing and streaming and stuff probably around 20 to 30 hours more so on the 20 side but on busy weeks during like the 30 side or so depending on the video she was shocked so and so if you guys are shocked about that I just wanted to go through this video and explain how it gets to like 20 or 30 hours by bringing you on a little bit of our week as far as balancing YouTube and um, a full-time job I wanted to start off the video with one of the most like not important mo most important parts but like a really main part of balancing is that I stream and shoot my videos and the video for Jack and I's couples channel on the weekends so we filmed the one that's going up on Jack and I's channel earlier today so it's Saturday by the way and then I always have the list of videos that I want to film on my phone so this is obviously one of them and then I have one more that I want to film um, either tonight it's already 10 30 but maybe I would film it tonight but yeah and then I also stream on Saturday so I finished up a stream about an hour ago and I just finished up normally I'll tweet before and either after the stream I let everybody know where I was streaming and I tweeted that out and where you can find me and then I um, posted after the stream a fun little clip of the stream and thanking anybody who rated me that's what just happened there and it was really fun and honestly it was like one of the best streams ever but yeah so streaming shot Mac and Jack channel video today I'm shooting this video for my channel and that just means I have one more video to shoot for my channel we're gonna film that in a little bit and I will take you guys along so in summary that makes two dingle channel uploads one Mac and Jack channel upload and then a stream on my twitch channel every week so that's what I do um, while trying to balance a full-time job so <laughs> can't like take you into work but like I can show you um, then what happens during the rest of the week and where those hours go rest of the week in order to make these videos work so that's the idea just in case you guys were wondering I think I'm gonna shoot that uh, video right now so I'll take you guys along okay bye <laughs> there you guys are right there. It depends on the video for sure Normally like I have the tripod kind of here and then it has my ring light on it So I have lighting if I am filming at night versus the daytime But then again, there are just some videos where I like to set up the camera super impromptu Even if it's a video that I'm planning on filming um, It just feels a little more right depending on the content of the video or like how I'm feeling of like getting out my thoughts But yeah, that video Video was a doozy um, as far as just a life update goes. I definitely shed a tear or seven. Um, I don't normally like to do why hide it if you're hurting or if you're going through something whether it's like really happy or really sad you know like instead of just hiding it on your platform or like whatever content you have. I just feel like showing that or being open about things just like connects you so much more to the people who have subscribed or are watching your videos because that's the stuff that I like to see. I like to see that someone is, you know, has a heartbeat like and is actually human rather than, hey guys, like blah 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 and then like turns off the camera and isn't like that, you know? Like there are plenty of days where I am so happy and I'm so excited and stuff but I also really want to show 
show the other stuff and it's really liberating and it's really exciting to like be able to do that not only for you guys and to show you guys like that side but also for me to look back on and remember like what I'm feeling and stuff so anyway I'm like literally getting into the video that I just filmed basically I just filmed that video thanks for coming along on our filming day um, that's usually what we do we get it done on Saturday and then it might eke into Sunday but Sunday tomorrow the Patriots are playing so we don't have time for that so all day today we literally spent in this apartment filming so I will see you guys I think Monday I'll take you on a little journey a little bit to work and then I'll see you after work and you'll see how we make time during the week for all the stuff we love to do all right I'll see you then mm, hello friends good morning so it is Monday I am just waking up as you can see I look really 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 good on a Monday it's around 8.05. Uh, my alarm's been going off since like 7.30. I usually press snooze until like 8 and then I hurry my butt into the shower. <sighs> Pack up and stuff and be in the office by 9. So we're gonna get going with that. <laughs> just as good as when I first woke up. Vlogging during the week is uh, is different. It is 8.51 now, so too far behind depending on traffic. We like to get into the office um, on like a normal day at like nine-ish or so. Since Jack and I only have one car, um, we'll just adjust depending on whose schedule is a little busier and who needs to get in first and stuff. So we'll do, I feel like if we even had two cars, I would want to like just go in with you anyway. I agree, it's always nicer just to go in together. Yeah, going into work one, alone is sad. I'm really happy that Jack and I have each other. on the bag. I will see you guys after work. Is that Baba? <laughs> Come back. Come. <laughs> Working with your husband is really great sometimes, you guys. We're free, you guys. Jack and I are on our way to the gym now. I am pretty tired, but I know that the gym is a good thing to do for our health and for my brain and it's a good in-between rather than just going home and eating and editing so we are gonna go to the gym I'll be my I'm not talking to him Why are you talking? so then oh my God. we're not talking to Jack right now wait why aren't we talking to Jack right now it's Jack's me why is Jack me because he talked back to me yeah. So anyway guys, it's only me and you for the rest of the day. Oh my god. I'm just talking. To you. <laughs> How I mean. So then we will <laughs> So yeah, that's what we're gonna do tonight. How does that sound to you? Good. Okay. Well we'll see you guys at the gym now. Okay, bye. Okay. Thanks for talking to me. Bye. Okay guys, so we're just gonna talk to no. each other now. <laughs> It is exactly 
seven o'clock. We try to leave the gym pretty consistently around seven. Right now we're gonna go have dinner and then by the time Jack starts streaming at nine, that's when I should start editing. So let's go make some food. Like, how does how is this possible? What did I do? Is it savable? No. Oh. All right, guys. I have admitted defeat after the second step of the recipe, and Jack has officially taken over dinner. I tried my hardest. When we say that I can't cook, I am not joking. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure The gonna be dinner is complete sense. We've got a homemade lighter fare Alfredo So it's not made with like as much fats and stuff But let's taste test I agree Mmm I think that's just as good that's really good. We're gonna watch the Gordon Ramsay's 24 Hours to Hell and Back. It's a great new show. It's like his kitchen nightmares, but with like a twist. And then, by the time we're done, it'll be ready for Jack's stream. We're gonna enjoy our dinner. So we just finished eating and we are so full. And um, I look like an egg, but we normally look on the iPad or snuggle and just be together for about like 10 to 20 minutes or so and just catch up on our day. Oh yeah. And then he goes to stream at nine and that's when I that's uh, when start to edit. That's when gets lit. That's when Liddy the, McTitty. the <laughs> final shut it snuggle off for now. Snuggle me, woman. I'll see you guys Love when me. I start to edit. Ah. Don't say, okay, ah. bye. So it is about nine o'clock and that has started to stream over there. And I have got my computer door over here. And so my uh, ritual is candles. And then the other ritual, I need something in the background and you guys know how much I watch YouTube. So I'll probably have that on in the background. And I have a video for Mac and Jack channel, our couples channel, that I'm just going to end. I'm gonna do a wrap up video there. And then I am probably going to start editing this one. What was my other video going on my channel this week? Oh, I have the other one. Never mind. But yeah, this is just the thought processes that go on when you're doing YouTube uh, with having a full-time job. You forget what videos are going up, but there is a plan. There is a plan in the back of my head. All right, let's get to editing, shall we? Interrupt this editing montage to go do some push-ups on Jack's stream. People can buy push-ups for Jack to do on stream with the stream currency that he has. So someone just bought him push-ups to do. So we're gonna go do that. Ready? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Here, hop on my shoulder. There you go. Okay, there you go. Good. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> My goodness gracious. No, my goodness gracious. <laughs> Miss Allie How has officially taken my seat and she totally knows that she did that. Hella good. Hella good. Look at how Wait, guilty you I look. Said. Do you know I'm how so guilty you, you look? Awful. She looks yeah. so guilty. You know you like All right, I'm going to finish up editing and then I will see you guys in a little bit. Hello there. That's my sound machine in the background in case you are wondering what that sound is. But it is around 11.30. I just finished editing. I brushed my teeth. I packed a little bit of a bag for tomorrow morning. Helps me just ready my morning a little bit uh, instead of like rushing around and stuff. But I finished one of the videos and I exported it. I just need to make a thumbnail. And so tomorrow will be um, probably taking the first cut at editing one of the videos going on my channel. So I started editing around like nine and then I ended around 11.30. So I usually do edit between two and a half to three hours a night. Uh, multiply that by five, you have about 15 hours-ish and then 
streaming on the weekend. We stream around three hours, but of course there's like the setup and prep and all of that stuff. So that's where um, the like 20 to 30-ish hours, depending on the complexity of the videos comes in. So let me know if this was interesting to you guys at all um, in the comments below. If you liked this sort of content, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you have any other kind of questions about YouTube or questions about how we do things, make sure to leave them in the comments below and we might be able to make a video about them. I love you all so, so much and I will catch you guys in my next video. See you later. Bye. I go anywhere, anywhere with you Cause you feel my mind Oh, you feel my mind We could be